Welcome to A State of Sight. I'm Isaac Porter and this is your update in ophthalmology and eye care. In this episode, I would like to explain foreign bodies that can get into the eye. Uh, we can see this many times, uh, particularly people that work with metal, whether it's drilling or grinding or hammering metal. Uh, or sometimes we'll see other objects that can come and uh, fly into someone's eye or hit their eye and can cause a lot of pain and irritation. Uh, when this happens, many times the piece of metal or the foreign object can become stuck in the eye. Uh, particularly we see this on the cornea, which as you remember is the clear shield that covers over the front of the eye. When something goes and hits the cornea, many times it can stick down just into the surface of the cornea since the very front part is a very soft layer called the epithelium that's like the thin coat that covers the front of the cornea. Because of this, if some small object sticks into the cornea, it may be down a little bit below the surface, a little bit like if you throw a rock into a bunch of mud, the rock can kind of sit and sink down a little bit in the mud but it won't be completely covered. When this happens, every time that someone blinks, they can feel this scratchy sensation when their eyelid passes over the foreign object. And because it's kind of stuck down in the surface, it's not easy for it to come out on its own. Uh, people can try rinsing their eye or flushing their eye, but if it still has persistent irritation, there may be stuck in there and require removal in the office by an ophthalmologist. To do this, we use the same microscope where we can get a very close view of the eye to take a look and see what exactly is in there. And then we can use uh, special instruments or brushes to remove the object out from the surface of the eye. If it is metal and has been there for a small period of time, uh, sometimes even as short as a day or two, it can start to form rust below the surface and surrounding the area. Uh, a lot of times this rust needs to be removed at the same time that the foreign object is removed to make sure that it's not interfering with the vision going forward. Also, when things get stuck in the eye, it causes a high risk for an infection. So we always look for that at the time and that we may need to use antibiotic drops in order to help cure or prevent further infection. If you have any questions about foreign objects going into the eye or getting stuck in the eye, please post your comments. We'd be happy to interact with you. And until next time, good health and good sight.